Hey Steven, it's Saturday. Yes, Normally that we would have fur today, but you know you'll we will dress for fur. What's happening here? Instead we're having black tie fur. Black tie it's fur. It's invitation only. So if That's you're not invited, a, I'm sorry. Yeah, you're not wearing a black tie though. No. Ah. It's a silver. But anyway, the the reason we're here is because uh, we even got professional camera guy here too. I mean using professional camera. Yes. Because today is a very, very special day. Today is dot com fur. Michael gets nail edition. That's right. So, and uh, there, there is the uh, the guy. He's very nervous right now. You can tell. He's just pacing around. He's hoping. He's hoping the future bride shows up. I guess. Yes. The future bride is hiding. <laughs> yeah. Normally, the bride is waiting at the altar. Yeah. But in this case, it's not to be reversed. We got the we bride have, is hiding. She's not coming out. Yeah. We have him and his best man waiting out there. Well, the what, bride, are, what are you? You his? I'm just a slave number one. His slave number one. The usher. You also <laughs> notice, even though this isn't dark info, who is the last to arrive? Ed. Yeah, where is Ed? He said he was coming. He said he was coming. Well, Ed, Ed's not here. Yeah. So, fur, wedding, mamispa, whatever. Yeah. <laughs> you can count on Ed being last. Yes. Mm-hmm. Uh, accident already. <laughs> Did you knock off your daddy's flower? You wanted a flower, didn't you? Yeah, you wanted a flower. And hey, look who's last. Even for a wedding, you're last. Chinese time. Yeah, <laughs> you're in China time. <laughs> Ed, we are going inside now. Now? Yes, because you <laughs> we were waiting for you. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay, let's go. Nice of you guys to wait for me. Yep. Congratulations. Good luck at being married. Uh, hope to still see you at foes sometimes. You know, not busy doing whatever married people do most of the days, like farmers markets, and IKEA. <laughs> Good luck, Leslie. Congratulations, Michael. Uh, I know this is like feeling off a bad day for you, but congratulations. So, John, wasn't it just a couple weeks ago that you were telling me how I showed up? How I usually show up to events, you know, slightly underdressed, maybe with my sleeves rolled up, with no jacket. What me. is with the lack of tie today, you know, at a tie. wedding? Uh, it's just the way it is. Dot com people don't wear tie. <laughs> yeah. I'm yeah. surprised but, you didn't wear a free shirt. Dot com do not wear tie. Did you get this shirt for free? I can't remember. <laughs> So yes. It's possible. <laughs> remember my last whole rent free shirt I got from being an extra at a, a TV show. Right now, the minister is giving some pretty good advice for Michael. Tell him to under-promise and over-deliver. Pleasure to present to you, Mr. and Mrs. Michael Kwok. Well, 
Welcome to table lucky number 13. We're here at uh, Michael Kwan's wedding, and for some reason he gave us this table. So, Ed's here, Leslie's here. So, Michael's friends that we never met before are here. Introduce yourself. Introduce yourself. Jason. Jason, you welcome. And he, you a school buddy of Michael's, or? Yeah, yeah. You went to school together, there you go, and you went to school together, there you go. And uh, we met Michael online. Yeah. At some point. At yeah. some point, yeah. yeah. Well, he works for me, so there you go. Uh, oh, hey, did you hear Hooters is suing another restaurant for stealing the trade secrets? Trade secrets? Yes, yes, Ben, they're suing. I don't know if they've been to, you know, other restaurants, you know, they're called sports bars. Wait, is sex sells trade <laughs> secret? Well, no, whoa, see. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Who, clad women in, at, at restaurants attracts dudes? Apparently, Hooters is claiming that the, a restaurant called Twin Peaks, with a, <laughs> with a yeah. slogan is, eat, drink, scenic view. <laughs> and they're claiming that Twin Peaks have stolen that, their trade secrets. That is not a trade secret. I mean, sex sells, as you said. Sex sells, eh? It's been around I since the dawn of time. The ingredients to the delicious hot wings. Uh, <laughs> I've never been. I never tried hot wings. I've never been in a Hooters yet, so. I have not. Also, I've just been told the hot wings. Are oh, you've been told the hot wings. I've been informed on by other people that have been to Hooters <laughs> that the hot wings are amazing exactly. and that there are girls in booty shorts everywhere. Is there food at Hooters? Wait, they wear shorts? <laughs> <laughs> never looked at. Never looked back. Yeah. I, I don't know myself, but from my friend that told me. <laughs> yeah. Well, Hooters is suing Twin Peaks. There were no Twin Peaks in, in the Southeast. I mean, have they yeah. been to other restaurants? Like, like what? Well, they're like, like Cactus Club? In Vegas? Yeah, every single restaurant in Vegas. Every restaurant in Vegas? Exactly. Yeah. Hell, if you went to Shark Club here on a game day. They could sue anybody. They could Maybe sue Hooters anybody. can patent. Why are we the, talking about this? I have no opinion. idea why we're talking about this. It just came out. <laughs> it's a monkey outfit. Hell yeah! It's for Lexi. It's a monkey suit. Lexi, it's your monkey suit. <laughs> That's great. Thank you. And Lexi is very, very happy. She's watching Dora the Explorer on my iPad. All right, there you go. Another one of Michael's friends from school. It's all Michael's school friend. And guys, he met on the internet. That is, that's a that is so true. <laughs> you know, Leslie is passing time by playing some food, food ninja. Because it's a great game. It is. And she's good at it. Apparently. <laughs> Not as good as Ed, but okay. <laughs> You're gonna have to smack your dad around afterward. They see me and they just assume I'm gonna eat it all. Uh, looks like we're getting specialized service. No, actually, no, we're not getting specialized service. The table next to us is. Yeah, the other table is getting specialized service. I mean, that table, we just popped the one big plate and we got nothing. Michael's friend, you know. Hey, what's up? Right now? Yeah, I'm recording. Yeah. It's because they're racist. Is it, uh, this is <laughs> this is Michael's friend's internet table. I mean, what the hell? That doesn't internet sound friends. very good. It, we're, Michael's we're internet that, friend. That Michael met on the internet. Yes, we are. Because that doesn't tell. Well, there's no context. There's no there's no context. So you're thinking everybody's gonna think, oh, he met them on Craigslist. You just got your butt felt up by the cry. Twice. Twice? Did she, did she thought you were Michael? I don't think she, well, 
I don't think, maybe the second time she might have, but I don't The second time so. she felt your butt. Which is really strange, because there's nothing similar about me and Michael. He's taller than me, I'm, you know, wider. Would you say your butt is bigger? I don't know. We've never compared our ass sizes. Okay. It's not something dudes do. Alright, well. But how about dudes who meet on the internet? Although, <laughs> yeah, with men you meet on the internet. That's <laughs> what you normally do. <laughs> although, I, I have to say, my butt's probably considerably larger than Michael's. Alright. Well, maybe that's why she needed to take two fields. <laughs> Alright, for those who are wondering, this curly thing in here, it's a shark fin. Shark fin too. What's it taste like, Leslie? I haven't tried it yet. Well, I'll give it a try and let us know what shark fin tastes like. I don't think it's real. It's, it's the no, it's real shark fin. That's definitely a shark fin. This is real shark fin. That's a real shark fin right there. Go for it. Now wait for Ed to do it. What? Yeah, that's your shark fin. Go for it. Now, technically, shark fin doesn't taste like anything, and really, this is this has got to be the most worst use of resources ever. Because what they do is they take the shark, they cut the fins off, and then they throw the rest of the shark away. What's with the sprouts? This is full, right? It, yeah, it's shark fin four. Shark fin full. Shark fin full. There you go. It's got to be like a ten dollar bowl of shark. It's totally the no. This is like. 30 to 40 bucks. Yeah, they're bloody expensive. Bloody expensive. This, this. Because, like I said, they kill the entire shark just with spins. Well, oh, I yeah, they it's, did. It, 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 it is quite. All right, so we're going to have a post We're going to have a round two of the game. Oh, round two. They're going to have girls go up. Dish, but if it's here, okay. I'm going to eat it. Yeah, go for it. We're going to have all the children's girls up here, please. Uh, oh. Savage oh Garden. My God. Drink. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, yeah. Come on, yeah, I can't split it. Tell us what the shark fin tastes like. <laughs> yeah, it's eating shark fin. How is it, Ed? Not bad. Yeah. The broth is, is amazing. But yeah. The shark fin just adds texture. It's a lot crunchier than, than usual. Oh, yeah. Usually it's quite soft and like noodles. Oh, they're going to do the other games. You know, she felt your butt. Now I guess uh, Michael's gonna feel some butt or maybe feel some breasts. I don't know. See the. Leslie, you're gonna go up. <laughs> go for it. You can get feel up, feel up by Michael. We'll see about that. <laughs> Well, yeah, I'm on shot. I got my shot. Yeah. Yeah. 